Two separate ventures to beautify the capital, Nairobi, have added up to nearly 100 million shillings. The first 48 million shillings project by former Governor Evans Kidero, who planted his famed Kidero grass, failed. And now Governor Mike Sunko hopes he will sustain his 50 million shillings venture. But for many of Nairobi's residents, this is just another county misadventure, Mel Miendo reports. Nairobi beautification program was initialized by former Nairobi governor Dr. Evans Kidero. Now at the time about 48 million Kenya shillings was said to have been pumped in that project. Enter in Governor Mike Sonko and yet again the same project, this time 50 million Kenya shillings of taxpayers' money. We get to find out from Kenyans whether this is worth it or not. It's too much to spend on beautification when there are other pressing issues like uh, the hospitals, the health, people are sleeping outside, villa amenities. I say this, and uh, of course, when I say this, 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 I say this. This was 2015 when the grass in the capital got a bit of the Obamacare ahead of the former U.S. president's visit to the country. The infamous Kidero grass cost the county 48 million shillings. The Auditor General raised questions on how the money for the exercise was obtained, yet it had not been included in the budget for the 2015-2016 financial year. The project lost its glamour a year after the important visit by the then U.S. President and the Pope. The grass withered as it wasn't being watered and was uprooted. Nairobi Governor Mike Sonko is now working on another beautification program that is expected to cost millions of shillings. If only to maintain, because you remember we had the Kidero grass which was looking good, but it didn't last. So is it helping the common Wanaiji? Fine, the city looks beautiful and all. Uh, is there water to maintain that? Those are the things we should look at. In September 2018, the Nairobi County government warned residents against stepping on grass and flower beds planted along major roads in the capital. But the whole idea has lost its appeal for many of the county residents who not only feel the venture is too costly, but there are many other pressing concerns. But here, 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 here. <laughs> you are 50M before mobs, huh? Eh, wangerekebisha kidogo, but tunawana tumefinywa kiasi. Kuna vile tumefinywa, lakini zasa tunasauti. Mel Miendo, NTV.